How tiny must these people have been back then? 2000 BC. Oh, let's get in here. Stormy when we arrived, uh, Storm Hannah struck. But on the way down yesterday, there was a storm warning, and it was only a storm warning. And then it turned slowly into a yellow, a yellow warning, and then an orange warning, and then it, it went all the way to the red warning. So last night was a bit, a bit rough. So we were three hours late arriving. That was fun, sitting in the car for two and a half hours on a motorway, not moving because of uh, an accident, and then. After the accident was cleared, someone broke down, so we were we were completely not moving for two and a half hours. So we had to cancel our Dingle Din Gin tour, and then we, but we made it. We're here, so happy days. We we arrived. Um, it's absolutely stunning this morning. It looks it looks fabulous. The views are fantastic. We're staying in an Airbnb. Um, the lady was really really nice. Uh, her name's Kate. She left us a lovely welcome card, and uh, it's got Wi-Fi. She has a fridge here that she gave us access to, and because it's her anniversary as well, she um, she gave Kira some prosecco as well, which was really nice. Uh, bought the prosecco, and we have some homemade buns. So uh, we're currently in the sitting room. I'm going to take you on a little tour in a minute. Uh, Kira's just in the shower, so I don't want to take you into that room just yet. But I'll show you around here and what we were doing last night. So let's grab this. This is my view at the moment. So that is our view from our bedroom as well, because obviously I'm in the sitting room right now, but that's more or less the view from the bedroom as well. And there's our, our little fridge where we had a Prosecco in there. Now in the fridge, we've got some strawberries. We've got some nice strawberries. We have some yogurts and we have some uh, I think they're grapes, or the, yeah, they're grapes, and then just some milk. We also have some chocolates, some water for the kettle, teas and coffees, and look at this, this, this is the best part. Some homemade buns. Looking forward to some of them later. And we even have some fruit. So, happy days. Uh, you can see Kira's empty glass from last night. So we just sat in last night, we came back around half eight, nine o'clock or so, and we just sat in and watched watched some TV because the, there was weather warning saying don't go outside if you don't have to and all that jazz. And We didn't really want to take the car down the, the town and stuff like that, but the, the town is amazing looking. You can see, I don't know if you can see that, I'll just try and focus a bit more. That's the, the kind of town there. You see all the cars parked along the main street. So that's where we are going for breakfast now in a few minutes. Take you into the bedroom. Make sure my life is decent. So this is the bedroom. We get dark in a minute because we have everything, everything closed because it was uh, we're just awake. So from here you can see you can see the mountains over there, which is great. And then on the other side. We open up these. As I said, oh, this is our view. So, just come outside for a minute. It's not even cold. It's actually quite warm, even though it's a little bit rainy. But this is our view. So you can see. It's quite really nice view. Looking forward to walking down the town in a while. I'm going for some breakfast. I don't know where we walk actually because it is raining a little bit. Kira's ankle still sore and it's still gonna rain. But anyway, that is the beginning of the Tuck the Vlog. That's the beginning of the tour. We're here for a couple of days in Kerry. Really looking forward to seeing a bit of Dingle, seeing a bit of Killarney, and on some of the, the other tours now. Our boat tour this afternoon has been cancelled, where we were meant to go and see Fungi the Dolphin or whatever. So we won't be doing that anymore. Um, I will be refunded for that. 
and we had to cancel the walking tour yesterday up one of the mountains because obviously Kira's ankle is wrecked and the weather is just not <laughs> it's not good weather for walking up mountains I don't think not safe so uh, we'll see you in a little while after breakfast Boo. Good morning guys, uh, so we've just had breakfast and we are about to head off on the sleigh head drive. So Kira's going to be doing all of the filming, no pressure. <laughs> and I have the GoPro set up for the road, so we're going to have a couple of b-rolls so you can see what it's going to be like around the place. Um, we read earlier that there's a big cycle rally tour thing on as well, so if we get caught in traffic Oops. again, whoops, I don't know. It just seems to be one thing after another on this trip so far. Anyway, wish us luck. Uh, the next thing you'll see is the B-roll and we'll get going. Enjoy, bye. The aim of the game here is to get this done and get up, get pictures before that hits. <laughs> That's more rain. Why is it everywhere we go together it rains, you and I, huh? These are super cool. Look at them. How tiny must these people have been back then? 2000 BC. Oh, let's get in here. The size of the place is tiny in here. It's like I can stretch my arms out and nearly reach across. Look. That's the, the trap door, you can see how much bigger I am. <laughs> oh man. It's cool in here. Kira, wanna? <laughs> Even, you have to Even I'm up. short or too tall for this. <laughs> I think you can stretch your arms out and really. Uh, no, I'm not even remotely able to stretch. <laughs> this is the perfect size for me. So what are I have these a little like? bed in here. <laughs> These, these guys had some view. Bet you they didn't pay 500,000 euro for a house back in the day. <laughs> or the equivalent. <laughs> God. They're right next to the sea as well. Jesus. Let's sit here. I wonder what happened. Oh, they're probably like thatched roofs or something, maybe, were they? 
Does it say in the pamphlet or? Well, no, you see, there would have been built up with stone, but that's why he said, well, actually, that one is. And then you'd have it build right up, and then you have one at the top that you could put on. So, you know, if you had a fire, you'd open it up so the smoke could get out. Mm. But, like, that wouldn't have been attached because there's no way that. Please do not climb on the wall. You will fall. Now that's fairly fucking obvious. Kira doesn't believe me that that uh, that that rain, is, uh, that bad black cloud is about to hit us. So she's just staying there and enjoying the sights. So I'm fucking off back to the car. She can stay out here if she wants with all these other people and get wet. But not for David. No, no. Uh, right. Yeah. Look, it's just about to hit that versus that. I'd rather be over there. Not over here. But we're actually driving. We're actually driving over here. So, <laughs> we'll find out how that goes. You'll see uh, on the dash cam, when I put the GoPro back on, uh, how well that goes. Go down now. I don't know if this is a good idea this way. Okay, we're at stop number two.